Hello, everybody. Firewall 2 Ultimate Gamer here with another episode of Pokemon Platinum. As you see, I came back to level 16 and Robin had to level 13 because you know what happens on level 14. In the last episode, we defeated Rourke, gym leader of Orberg City. He's Rock Tice. We just completely owned, and I'm gonna put Robin Hood in front because I think we have a rival battle after this. There he is. And he said he's hurting to turn the city. We couldn't go the way, um, like, north of the, um, gym because we need a bike. And so we're gonna have to go to Eterna City or whatever. I forgot the place. So, how are you guys, um, liking this series? I haven't gotten a lot of views, but that's alright. That's alright. I'm gonna keep uploading because I know these things start off slow. But I just doing this so I can get my channel started up. I want it to get started up, like little by little. I don't want to like have a bunch of things going on. So yeah, and there's Lookert telling us congratulations or whatever like that. So I'm gonna go to Pokemart and buy myself a repel and a couple mass potions. I mean super potions. My bad. And the Badoop is going to be the HM sleeve in this walkthrough. And this walkthrough is going to go to the end and the after game. So yeah, we're going to have them for quite some time. And up here, we're going to see Team Plasma, Professor Rowan, and Dawn. The, the Team Plasma just wants information from, Dr. from Professor Rowan so that they can get their hands on some new Pokemon over the world and change the world into their image. And so what Professor Rowan is doing right now, he's telling us that we need that me and Don need to help him out because these are these guys are really annoying him. And I understand when someone keeps asking you a question and you're like no 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 okay and they're like, please, man, come on, come on, come on. That is annoying. So, yeah, we're fighting T-Plasma. Our first double battle. Once again, I'm sorry, I'm too loud. So, they have a Stunky and a Glammy out. This isn't going to be too hard. As long as you're up to par with your levels, you should be just fine. So, uh... I was gonna go for the wing attack, but let me out decide to go for a fake out. Okay, wing attack, wing attack, wing attack. And turns we got your spike in the face. Stop growling! I'm still putting a troll fist on that glammy out. I'm going to put a troll fist on that glammy out. If I don't, I don't know what's wrong with me. Okay, Glamiel's almost dead, so we're gonna go with quick attack. Troll, ha, in your face. Don't troll the troll, never. And Fury Strikes on the Twig again. The Twig is the door, smart move. It's not very effective, but it gets energy back. I decided to go for, uh, I think, the turn. And we can attack. Poison gas, but don't hit me. Yes, he didn't hit me. Hit for twig! The twig just tackle. We can attack! Again! Darn it, it didn't die. Yeah, you focus your energy. Tackle. It's still not dead. What? Quick attack, boy. Get out of my house. Well, our house. 
Nah, my house. Robin Hood's level 14! Yeah! 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 And Robin Hood is going to evolve. Robin is evolving! Into what? Staravia! Staravia is going to stay with us throughout the Let's Play. Into a lovely, lovely Staraptor. And sadly, Monferno's not going to stay once I get my other team member. Sad face. Where? So Professor Roll is thanking us, and he's congratulating us also about the um gym badge. Thank you very much. And I want to talk about one thing right now, and it's the reason why I keep changing the sidebars. I decided this, I'm going to stick with this one. No more changing sidebars. I promise. I don't want you guys thinking I'm an idiot changing the sidebars over and over again. And here goes the fat man. But I keep changing the sidebars because I'm not. I was gonna see which ones I was happy with, and I'm happy with this one because I think it looks pretty good. So I guess he's telling us about the um, Poketch. But yeah, let's take a look at Robin Hood. Pretty cool. And we're gonna use a super potion. Because, you know, he took a little damage. And. Oh, yeah. Gotta teach Rock Smash to the HM Slave. Bidoof. I hate how TM's breaking this. Please. Why? And. Oh, a weak looking trainer. Do you wanna have a go? Weak. Girl, I'll show you weak. Shanks. Versus Star Avia. Star Avia, hands down. Unless it knows an electric type move. Which it won't do for a while. Wing attack. Not very effective. Really? See how much damage I did? Not effective. My face. Wait. Face. No, my foot. <laughs> stupid, that was stupid, that was stupid. That, that, that was stupid, that was stupid. My bad. I'm not gonna battle all these trainers, but him we're going to battle. Magic Harp? No. 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 Eight magic. Oh, then it's a monster. I considered that Gyarados, but then I was like, training a magic card. No. Never, ever in my life will I train another one of those. Just for a Gyarados. Never. Never in my life. Worst Pokemon moments ever. ever. Skip you. And we don't even have to battle you. The Ravaged Path. We're gonna go to the left. You can go either way. Left or right. Right, we'll take you to the next city. Well, the city that you're supposed to go to next. And left, we'll give you an item. TM Rock Tomb. But if you Rock Smash. You don't have to break the rocks to get to it. You can just go around like I did. Team. TM Rock Tomb. And I think you can come back here and surf later, and then you can find yourself something up there. So we're gonna go off to the right, and here you can find yourself a super potion. Nothing too big. Well, no, just regular potion. Um, skip you, because I don't care. But you, you have a Badoo. She has a Badoo and a Cherubi. A 
run my lady terribly. What do? And but, and we cut the dude's attack. We're gonna use wing attack, and the thing dies. Bye, Badoo. Bye, bye. Robin gained 130 experience points. She's about to send a Cherubi. Wing attack again. Goodbye, Cherubi. Get out my house. You too, Cricket's hot. She's coming up in here, cool. Oh, bye. You're one of those people. I see how it is. One twenty six experience points. We're almost level sixteen. We got a double battle up here, they both have Pachirisus. We don't really have a good matchup, but I don't think they know any legend type moves yet. They just have a quick attack. See both Pachirisus. And you shouldn't have any trouble with these trainers as long as your levels are in the area mine are. This game isn't hard to train in either. The Pokemons, the wild Pokemon levels are just terrible. Mach Punch that you have and they all they all jump for quick attack basically. That's why I say we don't really have to worry about Robin Hood being KO'd. Wing attack is not that very effective. Yeah that's not effective. Unlike that Shinx back there. Mach Punch that's gonna take down the first patch of Risu. And I think Robin I think yeah we're gonna go for return. And we're dead learns, I mean, Dead goes up to level 17, and I don't, I didn't nickname her, nickname her Dead because, because we're not going to use her, I just nicknamed her Dead because she's going to kill a lot of Pokemon then, and wow, turn to a lot of damage, because we turn, get stronger, and the more your Pokemon loves you, and your first battle out of the way, and if you see the video stop at one point, and then start up at the other, I just paused the video. That's all, okay? So yeah, that wasn't that hard. Health effects were off. Not, that's not gonna matter. Gonna, like, go past the grass. I'm gonna go heal my Pokemon. I'll be right back. And we're back again. And you're gonna. And later on, after the value win works, we're gonna have. You're gonna want to go up here. You'll see two collected grunts blocking your way, and which you're gonna go to next. I don't like being here with the flowers. What's wrong with flowers, man? I love spring and the flowers and things like that. It, it's just pretty outside. And once you walk up here, this little girl has got you, you, and her grandpa, I mean her dad, used to live at the Valley Windworks, but these bully, but these bu these bullies. Team Galactic kicked them out, but yeah, we're gonna continue going up there in the next episode. And because there's something here that I want, if I don't find it right now, I'm gonna cut the video. Nope, it's just a shell. I'll be right back. There's a weasel. There it is. 
next team member is going to be a weasel. His levels aren't bad. <laughs> Not bad at all. And it's a male, just like I wanted. We're gonna wing attack it. Kill it, don't kill it. Robin Hood, Robin Hood. Oh, and does pursuit. Perfect, 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 perfect. We're gonna go for a Pokeball. Pokeball, go! Gotcha! Weasel was caught! I love Weasel! It's my favorite water type Pokemon. It's a lot better. To me, it's a lot better than that Floatzel thing. If, but I like Floatzel too. Floatzel's pretty cool, but I just like Weasel more. And we're gonna nickname him Lifeguard. Why did I put an S there? Lifeguard. So Weasel has been added to our team. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Rate, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next later.